All right, news from India now. First pictures of Chandrayaan-2, India's second lunar exploration mission, are now out. ISRO is looking to add another feather to its illustrious cap with the upcoming launch of Chandrayaan-2. It is the sequel to India's first lunar mission, Chandrayaan-1, which was a huge success. The mission is expected to be launched by a GSLV MK3 vehicle in July of this year. What's special about this particular mission is that it includes a rover, a lander and a lunar orbiter, all of which have been developed in India. Now, the mission is going to go a step beyond Chandrayaan-1 and attempt a soft landing on the moon. In a fitting move, it has uh, seen the lander named after, or rather named Vikram after India's pioneering scientist and the father of India's space program, Vikram Sarabhai. The rover will spend around 15 days on the surface of the moon and conduct various scientific experiments. The data collected by the rover will be sent back to Earth via an orbiter. If successful, India will join an elite club of the US, USSR and China and become only the fourth nation to make a soft landing on the moon. Now, Our correspondent Nishita Virendra brings you the latest. Well, ISRO is all set to take off its Chandrayaan-2 mission in July this year that's expected to land on the lunar surface by September 2019. And for the first time, the modules of the Chandrayaan-2 mission have been kept on display at the ISRO campus in Marathalli in Bengaluru. What is on display here is the orbiter, which will revolve around the moon's surface at 100 kilometers. And then you also have the lander, which is a five-legged lander that is expected to, for the first time, make an attempt at making a soft landing on the uh, lunar surface. Now this lander will also have a rover along with it. The rover will have two payloads of the 14 payloads that are expected to go on board Chandrayaan-2 mission and these payloads will be key in assessing the lunar surface, the lunar topography, the lunar mineralogy as well as the exosphere and also find aspects to ascertain as to whether there is water ice on Chandrayaan or on the moon as it was ascertained in Chandrayaan. Chandrayaan-1. This is one of the most prestigious projects, missions that have been embarked on by ISRO. If ISRO is successful in making a soft landing on the lunar surface, then it will be only the fourth nation to be able to do so. If it is able uh, to land on near the south pole of the lunar surface, it is the first uh, mission to be able to do so globally as uh, the south pole of the lunar surface is largely an unexplored part of the moon and hence this is an extremely uh, coming of age mission for ISRO and it is expected to take off in the middle of July and land on the lunar surface somewhere on the 6th of September. In Bengaluru, with video journalist Chandan, Mr. Tavirendra, we on World